If you remember, I won at 2009 and yes, the two-time world marathon champion who trains at the global sports communication grounds in Kaptaga to Asingishu County is sharpening his arsenal ahead of the May 16th race. The assistant superintendent of police who is based in Mombasa was also geared up for the Tokyo Olympics but failed to make the cut due to stiff competition between the Kenyan marathoners. We ran in Valencia. I finished number number five or number something like that two zero five zero five. So then it is a, quali a big qualification uh, mark in any country. But then you see Kenya actually as a powerhouse of a sport. Eliud is there with the wild card, winning an admission run, and uh, another and a previous record holder under under two hours run. So you cannot say you 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 you, you remove this guy and put Kirui. There is evidence who has been, uh, this um, Gerono has been a consistent. And uh, we have got the Bruto, it's a growing athlete with the consistency also. The 2009 and 2011 World Marathon Champions medal will be put to test once again when he lines up at the Milano Marathon next weekend. My greatest teacher is now to um, finish Mil Milano. And if London is open, I know those guys will come to London. So I, it is my biggest prayer that... After this and after they, they finish the Olympic and then we pray that we meet together a uh, London Marathon. And like many other athletes around the world, the 38 year old has missed participating in key races due to the coronavirus pandemic. This has led to loss of valuable income. The last race I lost is a Mumbai Marathon, which I was to participate uh, that year of uh, this man. And now I lost the race because you see how India is now. And now that I am very lucky, I think I am a man of God, and I pray, and I, I got open the ways, and I found that my manager told me, Kiru, you are lucky that you have been entered uh, to participate the Milano Marathon in Italy. So that is now the focus. Uh. Kevin Kimathi, K24 Sports.